हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज सोनाली एंड यू आर वाचिंग वीकली करंट अफेयर क्विज लेट्स बिगिन टुडेस क्विज फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स इज और आर करेक्ट विद रेफरेंस टू आईएनएस सहयाद्री इट इज अ कावेरी क्लास स्टील मल्टी रोल फ्रिगेड बिल्ट फॉर द इंडियन नेवी इट इज कैपेबल ऑफ डिटेक्टिंग एंड न्यूट्रलाइजिंग एयर सर्फेस एंड सब सर्फेस थ्रेड्स बोथ ए एंड बी और नीदर ए नॉर बी द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी इट इज कैपेबल ऑफ डिटेक्टिंग एंड न्यूट्रलाइजिंग एयर सर्फेस एंड सब सर्फेस थ्रेड्स रिसेंटली अ मेरी टाइम पार्टनरशिप एक्सरसाइज वॉज कंडक्टेड विथ फ्रेंच नेवी इंडियन नेवीज इंडिजेनसली बिल्ट गाइडेड मिसाइल फ्रीगेट आई एन एस सहयाद्री पार्टिसिपेटेड इन द एक्सरसाइज आई एन एस सहयाद्री इज द शिवालिक क्लास एडवांस्ड स्टील माइंडेड गाइडेड मिसाइल फ्रीगेट वॉरशिप इट इज फिटेड विथ स्टेट ऑफ द आर्ट वेपन एंड सेंसर्स which makes her capable of detecting and neutralizing air surface and subsurface threats next question is which production process is based on an ideology of maximizing productivity while simultaneously minimizing waste lean manufacturing discrete manufacturing repetitive manufacturing or job shop manufacturing the correct answer is option a lean manufacturing recently union minister for msme launched the msme competitive lean scheme Lean manufacturing is a production process based on an ideology of maximizing productivity while simultaneously minimizing waste. By reducing waste to deliver process improvements, lean manufacturing sustainably delivers value to the customer. Next question is which of the following discovered a new antibacterial small molecule that is IITR00693 that could help in the fight against drug resistant infections? आई आई टी डेली गुवाहाटी मड्रास और रूड़की द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी आई आई टी रूड़की रिसर्चर्स एट द आई आई टी रूड़की हैव डिस्कवर्ड अ न्यू एंटी बैक्टीरियल स्मॉल मॉलिक्यूल आई आई टी आर जीरो जीरो सिक्स नाइन थ्री दैट कुड हेल्प इन द फाइट अगेंस्ट ड्रग रेजिस्टेंट इन्फेक्शंस इट हैज शोन एंटी बैक्टीरियल एक्टिविटी अगेंस्ट अ वाइड रेंज ऑफ ग्राम पॉजिटिव एंड ग्राम नेगेटिव बैक्टीरिया नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज ला पेरोस इज अ डिफेंस एक्सरसाइज टू बी कंडक्टेड बाय विच कंट्री Australia, France, USA or India. The correct answer is option B, France. The third edition of the multilateral exercise La Perros was conducted in the Indian Ocean region on 13 and 14 March 2023. The biennial exercise La Perros is conducted by the French Navy. Significantly, the first edition of the La Perros exercise was held in 2019. Next question is the Reserve Bank of India granted which of the following status to the Indian Renewable Energy Development Agency or IRETA investment and credit company mortgage guarantee company infrastructure finance company or microfinance company the correct answer is option C infrastructure finance company or IFC recently the RBI granted an IFC status to Indian Renewable Energy Development Agency or IRETA the recognition of IRETA as an IFC will increase the investors confidence enhance the brand value and generate a positive outlook in the market it was earlier classified as an investment and credit company or icc next question is what is the correct chronological order of the largest arms exporter countries india russia france china russia united states france china united states germany france china united states russia france china the correct answer is option d US Russia France and China Recently the report trends in international arms transfers 2022 has been released by the CIPRI According to the report the five largest arms importers in 2018 to 22 were India Saudi Arabia Qatar Australia and China and the five largest arms exporters were the US Russia France China and Germany Next question is consider the following statements One it is ISRO's second nano satellite for Bhutan Two, it was put into orbit by the Indian rocket Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle C-54 or PSLV C-54. Which of the following satellite has been mentioned in the statements given above? Bhutan One, Aryabhat, Bhutan Sat, or Cube Sat? The correct answer is option C, Bhutan Sat. The INS-2B or Bhutan Sat is ISRO's second nano satellite for Bhutan. The satellite was put into orbit by the Indian rocket. PSLV C54 on November 26 2022 it was launched as a piggyback payload to the Indo-French Ocean Observation Satellite EOS6 next question is what was the theme of World Consumer Rights Day 2023 empowering consumers through clean energy transitions 
टैकल प्लास्टिक पॉल्यूशन फेयर डिजिटल फाइनेंस और मेकिंग डिजिटल मार्केट प्लेसेस फेयर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए एम्पावरिंग कंज्यूमर्स थ्रू क्लीन एनर्जी ट्रांजेक्शन वर्ल्ड कंज्यूमर राइट्स डे इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन मार्च फिफ्टीन एवरी ईयर विद एन एम टू रेज ग्लोबल अवेयरनेस अबाउट कंज्यूमर राइट्स एंड प्रमोट कंज्यूमर प्रोटेक्शन दिस ईयर द थीम ऑफ वर्ल्ड कंज्यूमर राइट्स डे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री वॉज एम्पावरिंग कंज्यूमर्स थ्रू क्लीन एनर्जी ट्रांजेक्शन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज एक्सरसाइज बोर्ड कुरुक्षेत्रा वॉज कंडक्टेड फ्रॉम सिक्स टू थर्टीन मार्च ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री एट जोधपुर मिलिट्री स्टेशन इंडिया इट इज अ मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज बिटवीन इंडिया एंड विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग कंट्रीज भूटान जापान श्रीलंका और सिंगापुर द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी सिंगापुर रिसेंटली द थर्टींथ एडिशन ऑफ द इंडिया सिंगापुर मिलिट्री एक्सरसाइज बोर्ड कुरुक्षेत्रा कंक्लूडेड दिस एक्सरसाइज वॉज कंडक्टेड फ्रॉम सिक्स टू थर्टीन मार्च ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री एट जोधपुर मिलिट्री स्टेशन इंडिया फर्स्ट कंडक्टेड इन टू थाउजेंड फाइव दिस एक्सरसाइज अंडर स्कोर द स्ट्रॉग बायोलेट्रल डिफेंस रिलेशनशिप between both countries and enhances cooperation between the two armies next question is which of the following are the pillars of atl sarthi a comprehensive self monitoring framework to strengthen the ecosystem of atal tinkering labs one my atl dashboard two compliance sops three cluster based approach four pe metrics options are 1 3 and 4 only 1 2 and 3 only 1 2 and 4 only or 1 2 3 and 4 The correct answer is option D. One, two, three, and four. Recently, Atal Innovation Mission Niti Aayog launched ATL Sarthi, a comprehensive self-monitoring framework to strengthen the ecosystem of Atal Tinkering Labs or ATLs. The initiative has four pillars, ensuring the performance enhancement of ATLs through regular process improvements. My ATL dashboard, compliance SOPs, cluster-based approach, and performance enablement. That is PE metrics. Next question is which of the following ministry implemented the Niksha Mitra initiative Ministry of Health and Family Welfare Ministry of Home Affairs Ministry of Education or Ministry of Finance The correct answer is option A Ministry of Health and Family Welfare Under the Pradhan Mantri TB Mukt Bharat Abhiyan Niksha Mitra initiative 9.55 lakh out of 9.69 lakhs consented TB patients across the country have been adopted by Niksha Mitra Nikshe that is ni means and and kshe means tb is the web enabled patient management system for tb control under the national tuberculosis elimination program or ntep next question is recently border roads organization opened the strategic zojila pass on the greater himalayan range it remained closed for how many days this year 73 71 69 or 68 the correct answer is option d 68 Recently border roads organization opened the strategic Zojila Pass on the Greater Himalayan Range. The pass acts as a gateway between the union territories of Ladakh and Jammu and Kashmir. The pass was kept open for traffic till January 6 through relentless snow clearance operations ensuring that it remained closed for only 68 days this year as compared to 73 days last year. Next question is the Colombo Security Conclave was formed in 2011 as a trilateral maritime security grouping of which of the following countries 1 India 2 Sri Lanka 3 Bangladesh 4 Maldives options are 1 2 and 3 only 1 2 and 4 only 1 3 and 4 only or 2 3 and 4 only the correct answer is option b 1 2 and 4 only the colombo security conclave was formed in 2011 as a trilateral maritime security grouping of india sri lanka and maldives the road map of activities was expanded in 2022 and adopted by the member countries that is india sri lanka maldives and mauritius with bangladesh and seychelles participating as observer countries next question is national immunization day is celebrated on March 14, 15, 16 or 17. The correct answer is option C, March 16. National Vaccination Day or National Immunization Day is celebrated on March 16 every year across the country. The day aims to spread awareness about the importance of vaccines in human health. The day was first celebrated in 1995 with the government launching Pulse Polio Immunization Program to fight polio. Next question is which of the following statement or statements is or are correct with reference to exercise C Dragon 23 1 it will be conducted by the US Navy 2 this will be the third edition of the coordinated multilateral anti submarine warfare exercise options are 1 only 2 only both 1 and 2 or neither 1 nor 2 the correct answer is option C both 1 and 2 exercise C Dragon 23 is scheduled from 15 to 30 March 23 
and will be conducted by the US Navy. This will be the third edition of the Coordinated Multilateral Anti-Submarine Warfare or ASW exercise for long-range maritime reconnaissance aircraft. Next question is which of the following statement or statements is or are true with reference to recent notification released by the Bar Council of India. 1. The Bar Council of India has allowed foreign lawyers and law firms to practice in India. 2. They can practice Indian law. Options are 1 only, 2 only, both 1 and 2 or neither 1 nor 2. The correct answer is option A, 1 only. Recently, the Bar Council of India has allowed foreign lawyers and law firms to practice in India. The notification essentially allows foreign lawyers and law firms to register with BCI to practice in India if they are entitled to practice law in their home countries. However, they cannot practice Indian law. Next question is, how many abort missions are planned for India's maiden human space flight Gaganyaan? 1, 2, 3 or 4? The correct answer is option D, 4. The first of the four abort missions for India's maiden human space flight Gaganyaan is planned for May this year. The first test vehicle mission TVD-1 is planned for May 2023, followed by the second test vehicle TVD-2 mission and the first uncrewed mission of Gaganyaan LVM3G1 in the first quarter of 2024. Next question is which Indian film won the best original song Oscar at the 95th Academy Awards? The Elephant Whisperers, RRR, The House That Ananda Built or An Encounter with Faces? The correct answer is option B, RRR. The song Natu Natu from the hit Telugu language film RRR has made history by becoming the first Indian film song to win an Oscar. The Oscars were held on March 13 in Los Angeles Dolby Theatre. Next question is which Indian documentary won an Oscar at the 95th Academy Awards? The Elephant Whisperers, The House That Ananda Built, An Encounter With Faces or None of the Above? The correct answer is option A, The Elephant Whisperers. Recently, The Elephant Whisperers won the 95th Academy Awards Best Documentary Short Award. The 41-minute short documentary was produced by Achin Jain and Guneet Monga and was directed by Kartiki Gonzalez. Last question is the Global Recycling Day was established in which year? 2017, 2018, 2019 or 2020? The correct answer is option B, 2018. Annually, March 18th is designated as Global Recycling Day to raise understanding of the people about how our environment is harmed due to plastic. The day also raises awareness of recycling as an idea and an important concept. On March 18th, 2018, Global Recycling Day was established. People throughout the globe were encouraged to recycle. So that's all for today. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching.